It's as if the Third World War is being rehearsed across the entire planet, and the possibility of a nuclear war is closer than you and I can imagine. However, there are some people who fully understand this reality, and they've already started to flee. Who are they? They are the wealthiest individuals on the planet, people like Bill Gates, Elon Musk, and Jeff Bezos. The question arises, where are they fleeing to? They cannot escape beyond Earth, so now they are busy hiding underground. Surprised? Recently, you and I may not have been able to grasp what's happening across the world, but the richest people on Earth certainly do. That's why they are spending billions of dollars to create safe hideouts for themselves. In simple terms, they are building an entire underground world, a paradise of sorts, but not just any ordinary world. This is a luxurious haven. Without further ado, let's try to take a sneak peek into their secret lairs. It's easy to assume that the wealthy don't hesitate to spend money on their safety. In America, there are many companies that specialize in building underground bunkers, and these companies cater specifically to the rich, creating lavish, state-of-the-art bunkers for those who want to shelter themselves in the event of any disaster or a nuclear war. Unfortunately, while these billionaires will be partying inside their multi-million dollar bunkers, a nightmare will be unfolding on the surface. These bunker building companies believe that if there's one thing a bunker can't go without, it's a swimming pool and a cinema hall. Many experts believe that a significant number of wealthy Californians have already purchased secret bunkers, anticipating that a nuclear war may break out soon. In such a terrifying situation, they are already spending millions of dollars to secure their survival. As days pass, the demand for these bunkers is increasing all over the world. Interestingly, some of these special bunkers come with tunnels that stretch for several kilometers, ensuring that the owners never have to surface again. They can move freely from one place to another through these tunnels. One of the most notable bunkers is located in Indiana, USA. The inside looks exactly like a five-star hotel, complete with a movie theater, swimming pool, and all other luxuries. The bunker is equipped with everything necessary to keep it warm, including about a year's worth of fuel and food supplies. Another famous bunker is called Europa One, which was constructed during the Cold War. This massive bunker is 34 stories deep underground, with each floor measuring over 230 square meters. It has everything from cinemas and swimming pools to gyms and luxurious bathrooms. Only the bunker building company knows what other secrets are hidden inside. Another favorite place for billionaires is New Zealand. Believe it or not, there are villages in New Zealand that are entirely made of underground bunkers. According to the companies that build them, creating one of these bunkers costs about $8.5 million. And even after spending such a large sum, all you get is nine bedrooms, five bathrooms, a garage, a gym, and an office. Oh, and don't forget the underground garden that comes with it. You may be wondering, who would spend so much money on these? You'd be surprised to know that sales of these underground bunkers surged dramatically during the COVID-19 pandemic. However, some experts believe New Zealand may not be the most suitable place for such bunkers, as it is surrounded by oceans and is prone to tsunamis. There's a high chance that these underground bunkers could flood during a disaster. Nonetheless, Many experts believe that Amazon founder Jeff Bezos has already purchased one of these luxurious bunkers in New Zealand. Bill Gates, too, bought several underground bunkers back in 2015. After hearing this, you might think that only the extremely wealthy can survive a nuclear war or similar disaster. But that's not entirely true. Some people have found alternative ways to build their own private bunkers without spending millions. You could even build one yourself if you wanted to. For instance, many have used their ingenuity and hard work to construct private bunkers on a small budget. One of the biggest private bunkers in the world is located in North America. It was built by a Canadian man who is now 85 years old. He constructed it during the Cold War, when he feared a global catastrophe was imminent. In his youth, he dug a massive hole and amusingly placed 40 old school buses inside. Then he covered them with concrete and dirt creating a structure about four meters high. This bunker comes equipped with an electricity connection, water supply, sewage system, and ventilation. 
Amazingly, this single-man project can accommodate over 500 people. Many of us are aware that in the early 20th century, the fear of nuclear war was quite strong. As a result, the world's major superpowers began preparing for a nuclear apocalypse. Governments and political leaders in various countries started making arrangements for their personal safety. Several bunkers were built for official purposes as well. One such bunker is the Greenbrier Bunker, which was constructed when America's relations with Cuba reached their lowest point. The American government started working on this bunker to use it as an alternative to Washington, D.C., in case of an external attack. For nearly 30 years, the bunker remained a top secret, and only a handful of people knew about it. Interestingly, the main gate of this bunker weighs over 25 tons. After being kept a secret for a long time, the existence of the bunker was revealed by journalists in 1992. On the other hand, America's eternal rival, Russia, is also not far behind in building bunkers. The largest bunker in Russia is located in Moscow, and it was built in the 1950s. This bunker contains everything necessary for survival during a disaster, from fuel and food to clean air. What's more, this bunker is connected by tunnels to a nearby metro station in Moscow. Although it's now been turned into a museum for visitors, its massive infrastructure is awe-inspiring. Another bunker, Bunker 703, is also now a museum. Located 43 meters underground, it was open to visitors in 2018. Some believe it was built almost 100 years ago, in 1931, under the orders of Soviet President Joseph Stalin. The deepest part of this bunker is around 100 meters underground. It was primarily constructed to store grain, industrial equipment, and essential medicines during a nuclear war. This colossal bunker was designed to provide grain supplies for the entire Russian population during a nuclear catastrophe. Some believe that there are even more secret chambers deep inside this bunker, but no one has discovered what they contain.